I've been following Depth vs. Herd for about two years now, maybe a little more, and what you see all the time are people posing as Johnny Depp. Now, some people make accounts after him, his name, in goodwill, and they're serious, they spread facts and things like that. But some of them actually pose to be Johnny to get people's WhatsApp accounts, email numbers, and things like that. And those are the people Johnny here is actually now calling out himself. So he posted this on Instagram, and it says, I've been made aware that there are fake accounts pretending to be me or people working with me. I do not have any private or side accounts on any platforms. These are the only pages run by me and my team where we share updates and communications, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and Discord. And missing is Twitter. A lot of people are wondering why Twitter's missing. There's speculation that Twitter won't let Johnny make an account or something like that. I'm not sure. It's not clear. I wish I had an answer. We shall see what happens in the future. As you guys might know, Elon Musk is taking over Twitter and he claims he is hardcore about free speech or you could say a free speech purist. So even though he's got a history and he's been entangled with this case, I think if he does get on and he does get on and takes full power and everything, he might let Johnny have an account if something's going on fishy there where Johnny can't make an account. But time will tell. And he continues, I ask that you remain cautious as it seems these fake accounts can be relentless. My team is working to combat the problem. Thank you for your continued support and for making me aware of this issue. Love and respect, Johnny Depp. Now, I'm not sure what his team can do, to be honest. I mean, there's probably tens of thousands of people out there around the net posing to be Johnny. So, I'm not exactly certain how they go about getting rid of them, but I'm sure they've got some tactic. They could probably get most of them out of the way or start cracking down or at least putting it out there that Johnny knows about it, discouraging people from trying it. And by the way, Johnny's Instagram is on over 25 million people. Last I made a video about a month ago or so, he was on 13 million. So this is a huge explosion, but the point is, He's going to get the word out there to a lot of people, which is a great thing I don't see a lot of other celebrities doing. So, I approve. Also, I have seen these bots and these fake accounts come around to my channel, and once in a while somebody does say, Is that Johnny? Is that really Johnny? And I think the people are serious. I mean, you gotta remember, not everybody is so computer savvy, where they just look at an account and they automatically know what it is. Maybe older folk, I'm not sure, no offense to anyone, but I'd assume somebody who's not totally into technology, computers, social media, and stuff like that might actually think for a second it could be Johnny. I mean, I've told people flat out, no, it's not him. I have seen speculation on this channel. So it is, again, because of that reason, a good thing Johnny's calling this out personally. And as you can see right there, Jason Momoa still follows him. Hopefully we get some news on that. I'm pretty interested for Jason's actual honest opinion on this case and Amber. Maybe moving forward, when he does interviews for Aquaman 2, people are going to ask him. It's probably going to come up at some point, so we shall see. Anyway, a little off track there, but I saw Pride of Gypsy, so I figured I'd mention that about Jason and some speculation. But you guys let me know your speculation down below on these bots on Johnny on Instagram, I'm doing pop culture, celebrity news, stuff like that. Consider subscribing here. If you don't subscribe, I guess I'll be sad about it, but I'll get over it, make a new video, something like that. Rant done for now. See you next time.